What's up and welcome back to another video. Today we will be discussing and analyzing whether or not it is easy to get the legendary loot that drops from the Handsome Sorcerer. Now, if you guys do not know, the Handsome Sorcerer can actually drop several different legendaries. I will go ahead and list them off to you now. He has a chance to drop the legendary Conference Call Shotgun, the legendary Impaler, the legendary Flacker, the legendary Leech Grenade mod, and also the very unique legendary Handsome Jack's Mask, as well as the Volcano Sniper Rifle. Which, in case you guys do not know, is the same exact loot pull as another boss in the game, the initial end boss, which is the Warrior. And if you were wondering how to fight the Handsome Sorcerer, well, what you're going to need to do is actually complete the entire Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon Keep DLC, as he is actually in the very last mission. Once you complete Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon Keep DLC, you will then be able to farm the Handsome Sorcerer. Now if you guys are not familiar with this series, how easy is it to get, we will be killing the Handsome Sorcerer 100 times to figure out how easy are these legendaries to get. But wait, there's more. Because in this video, we actually have two uniques that also have a chance to drop from the Handsome Sorcerer, those being the Magic Missile and the Fireball. These uniques are blue rarity items, and I will also be calculating the percentage of these drop rates during the course of this video. And with the Handsome Sorcerer, he actually has a chance of dropping other legendaries that are not specific to his loot pool. Meaning that we could get a Maggie, we could get an Infinity Pistol. You really never know what could happen with this boss, as his loot pool is not entirely known to the public. And with that being said, let's go ahead and try and figure out what kind of legendaries this guy can drop. Let's hop in to the 100 runs. Alright, all right, this will be kill number one. You can get a lot of different things from this guy, including the Impaler Shield, the Conference Call, the Flacker. All the warrior drops, the volcano is in there, the leech, also Handsome Jack's uh, head, the legendary one. I think he may, he might even be able to drop the purple one, I'm not 100% on that. But he can also drop, I think the Curb Blaster is in his loot pool, and the Baby Maker. It's kind of honestly hard to find out his exact loot pool. Alright, there we go. That'll be kill number one. Let's see what we got. Did we get any legendaries? The legendaries, at least in my experience, have always really dropped around this area. So I'm going to be looking right here when the loot comes out. Doesn't look like I got anything on run number one. See what we got. Um, what is that? The fireball? Nope, magic missile. All right, that's pretty cool. So we did get that. Let's see if we got anything else. Skin. Bunch of iridium. Purple. Another purple. Wait a second. We got the fireball as well. Oh wow. We got ourselves a firestorm on the way up here. So I mean that's the first legendary of the video. Has absolutely nothing to do with the handsome sorcerer. But I mean, oh well. Run number five, let's see what we got. Loop, loop, loop. And just another. Well, actually, that's a, we haven't got the lightning bolt yet, so. Something new, I suppose. Alright, that'll be run number ten. What do we got? 
still no legendaries. Ten runs in. At least as far as I can see. Yeah. Still nothing. Legendary, finally. It's the Impaler, I saw it. I was gonna try and run around, try and not see it, but I saw it already. So, that's first legendary from the actual sorcerer of the video is the OP-10 Impaler. Not too bad. There we go. Kill number 13, see if we can't get it back to back. Oh wow, we did get something else. Oh boy. Here we go again with the back-to-back -back drops. Let's see how this video goes. Alright. I think it was a sniper, so it's probably the volcano. Matt, we're going to have to run over there and take a look. What do we get? Yep, sure is an OP-10 volcano. And it looks like we also got... Oh, no. I thought we had a fireball over there, but it's not. I mean, a volcano, though. Pretty cool. Magic Missile. And probably not much more. Be cool for a little shot again. Other than that, not much. number number 17 the luck on this number in the previous runs hasn't been the best wait a second we did get a legendary can't complain about that let's go see what it is whoa okay I don't know if he's supposed to drop this I actually have no clue um this might be a world drop we're gonna have to wait and see if I get this within the rest of the video the Quasar. Uh, as far as I know, the Handsome Sorcerer is not supposed to drop the Quasar. So, I guess we're just going to have to wait and see on this one. There we go. Yeah, this one goes. Stay still, pal. There you go. And, run number 21. Got ourselves a fireball. Nope, magic missile. My bad. There we go. Run number 24. And we got ourselves yet another volcano on this one. And the magic missile. OP-10 Banbury volcano. Not too bad. Run number 25. See if we can't get anything. And looks like we got ourselves another magic missile. There we go. Oh, wait a second. Okay, a nasty surprise. Um, sh uh, now I'm really bamboozled here. So I thought it was going to be another Quasar, because, you know, just the way they look. They're very similar, the Hyperion grenade mods, the legendaries. Um, but no, it's a nasty surprise, not another Quasar. I was going to be like, okay, we can confirm that the Quasars will drop and move on. But um, no, we're actually adding another legendary to the pool here of possibility, the nasty surprise. I don't know if this is a world drop. I don't know. Go. Run number 28. 
What the hell do we got here? The magic missile. You're number 20. What do we have? Legendary. Is that the head? Oh, whoa. Hold the. F what? A legendary psycho head? Whoa. This dude's loot pool is all over the place. I'm gonna have to Google this head real quick. Alright, I did a quick Google search and I found out that this actually is the Handsome Jack's mask for the psycho. So, um, yeah, it's not really that rare. It's Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. The leech and the tortoise. Now, oh, uh, okay. Run number 34 has taken an unexpected turn. We've got our first double drop of the video. Never have I ever seen the tortoise drop from this guy. I mean, the leech, that's from the warrior, so that's to be expected here. But... The tortoise is supposed to drop from a boss named Blue in the Caustic Caverns. Not from him, as far as I know. So, I'm going to pick it up and move on. There we go. We're number 37. Okay. Is that? Yep, it is. A nice little flacker. So we've seen every single warrior drop so far, except for the conference call. I think, right? I'm not missing any of them. I think I've seen them all except for the conference call. Let's make this a quick one. There we go. Nice. Run number 40 complete. Let's see what we get. And looks like a fireball hit me on the top of my damn head. Number 45, we got ourselves a, a fastball. So the loot pool continues to open up further and further with the handsome sorcerer. Wow, that's probably the coolest drop we've actually got of the video, in my opinion. There we go. Run number 47. Saw two things come out. Is that the head? Yep. Sure is another head. I hear your blood. That's what it's called. So, after doing a little bit of research, I was able to find out this is an yet another one of those heads that you can achieve from the Warrior and Gary. So, pretty weird nonetheless. Um, pretty cool though, since I didn't have it. Run number 50, halfway point, got ourselves a magic missile to prove it, and yeah, bushwhack, shield, not much more. Nice. Run number 55, hold on, I see it, ourselves a legendary. And it is the leech. So what is that, the second time we've seen the leech? Second or third, I can't remember. I think only the second, though. Because we got we had that electric one. That's the only one I remember getting, so... Pretty cool. Alright. Run number 58. Hold on, I see something. That'll be our, what, third volcano? Third volcano of the video. Cool, cool, cool. All been the same prefix, too. Cool. And run number 59. What are we going to see this time? Another legendary. What's this? Ah, third leech of the video. 
pretty cool, pretty cool. So the warrior drops are starting to come in more and more as these uh, runs come along. So that's good, at least. Come on. There we go. Kill number 60. If I would have died, I would have been pissed. What do we got, ladies and gentlemen? Just another magic missile. Run number 61. And. Ahead. Screw you, game. Nice. Alright. 67 runs in. What do we got? Legendary. Is that a leech? Yup. Fourth leech of the video. Three of them have been electric. So, I mean, that's interesting. There you go. What do we got? Hold on. There's a shield there. And it is the Impaler. For I believe, what, the second time? I think this was the first legendary we saw out of the Warriors loop pull. It's the first one we've seen since run number 13. So, it's pretty interesting. There we go. Run number 77. Let's see what we got. Ah, the head again. Gotta love it. There we go. Run number 80. Let's see what we got. Nope. Not seeing much. What? What? A pearlescent? What? Okay. I have never seen that. I have never seen a pearlescent from the handsome sorcerer. Now, I've seen a couple from the warrior, but never from the handsome sorcerer. We got ourselves a saw bar. Oh my god. Okay. I'm going to have to pick this up respectfully. A great view, isn't it? Oops. There it goes. We're on number 83. Let's see what we got. Oh, got to show the legendary. Is that the leech? Yep. Oh, rubberized. That is disgusting. That makes me want to puke a little bit. Ew. And run number 84. Let's see what we got. Hold on now. A double drop. A double drop. What? A striker. There's another flacker, but a striker. What? What? There's no way a striker's in. Is a striker in his loop pool? I mean, I don't know. This is wild, guys. The amount of. I just picked up some blue. Wow, the amount of drops we've gotten in this video is absolutely ridiculous. There we go, run number 88. Hold on now. Uh, a legendary Berserker class mod. Oh boy. The loop pool continues to just open more and more and more. This guy may just be able to drop every damn thing in the game. Let's be honest. I really don't know. Nice. We're on number 89. What do we got? Wait a second. Another volcano. 
And for the first time, I believe, it's not the uh, Banbury one. So, I mean, pretty cool. Something different. We're on number 94. Uh-uh. We're on number 95. What is that? Yeah, it is another flacker. Hmm. See, so we got four runs left, so... This could be our last drop. Could be. There we go. We're on number 96. Oh, and the game proves me wrong with back to back flacker drops. Thanks, game. Okay, that is ridiculous. Oh my god, three in a row, another head. We got the handsome Jack's mask, the legendary version, for the siren. Wow. Last run? I don't think so, but I mean, maybe. Alright, I guess we're about to find out. Run number 100, here we go. And... <laughs> The head drop for the Necromancer. Yep, there it is. And that's it for the 100 runs. Alright, there it is, the 100 runs of the Handsome Sorcerer. You guys just saw it. We are going to now discuss and analyze whether or not it is easy to get the legendaries that are inside the Warrior's Loot Pool from the Handsome Sorcerer. Now in my personal opinion, with such a big loot pull, it has to be pretty damn hard to not get a legendary while doing a hundred runs of the Handsome Sorcerer. Now that is just one person's humble opinion, that being myself. Before I get to talking about the legendary drops though, I wanna go ahead and mention the Magic Missile, the Fireball, and the Lightning Bolt. Now very interestingly enough, we actually got one of these grenades a lot more than the others. That grenade mod being the Magic Missile. We actually achieved it 17 times, giving you a 17% chance at the drop. The Fireball, only 13. The Lightning Bolt, only 7. So out of the three unique grenade mods that you can get from the Handsome Sorcerer, I think we got a clear winner on which one is the most common, that being the Times 2 Magic Missile. The Fireball then came in at second place with 13 different drops, and then the Lightning Bolt in third with 7. Alright, so before I hop into talking about the legendary drops of the video, I want to go ahead and hop into the document and talk about what happened to it, because it's actually a pretty funny story. So after I finished the 100 runs, I actually wasn't able to do the analysis and discussion right away. I actually had to go away and watch a house for a couple of weeks. So the only thing I could actually do was take a picture of the document and hope that my computer wouldn't turn off so that I could get back to my computer and do the document and finish up this video. But my computer actually shut off in the time that I was away from the house, so the only thing I have is this picture. Now with that out of the way, we actually did get 23 different legendary drops from the handsome sorcerer. Now in my opinion, this is pretty damn good. 23 legendaries is a lot. And the crazy part to me is that six of them were actually not a part of the warrior's drop loot pool. Now I'm gonna go out on just a tiny little limb here and say that the handsome sorcerer can actually drop any legendary in the game at chance. While I can't 100% confirm this, I have done, done my testing, I did the 100 runs, here is my information, all I can do is present it to you guys. We also saw one pearlescent dropout during this video, which we all know that it actually is possible to get pearlescents from the warrior, so that could also just be a part of that loot pool. But yeah, all in all, this was a super fun video to make, and figuring out what this guy drops was a lot of fun, and I would be lying if I told you otherwise. Now, 
Let's answer the question. All right, all right. It is now time to answer the age-old question. Is it easy to get legendaries from the handsome sorcerer? After doing my testing, you have a 23% chance to get a legendary from the handsome sorcerer. That being the highest percentage of any legendary that we have tested so far. Him having a large loot pool also might increase this, so you have to take that into account. But I would have to say that yes, it is easy to get legendaries from the handsome sorcerer. I hope this video was able to answer your guys' question about the legendaries that you can achieve from the handsome sorcerer. I think it is super interesting that this hasn't been talked about because his large loot pool is honestly something that I think more players should look into. Go ahead and comment down below what kind of random legendaries you guys got from the handsome sorcerer and tell me what you guys want to see next on how easy is it to get. And with that being said, I hope you all did enjoy this video and if you did make sure to smash a thumbs up on it, subscribe down below, and I will see you guys next time.